seen some shit online that's pissed me off, really. Because there's so much deceiving things happening. And we're not paying attention. Big up yourself, whoever's online, man, as I respect you know the thing already. Big up yourself, unruly KV. Man, them, I feel like on a, on a serious level, you see 2023? For 2023, man, them need to ease off the Instagram model chicks, them, loud them, loud them, loud them. Loud all this Instagram, looking for gal on Instagram and all that, checking gal on Instagram. Man, them for loud that, you're putting your life in danger. Either you're putting your life in danger because some of these girls have got AIDS, bro. Some of these girls have got HIV, bro. Some of these girls are way beyond what we... You know what I mean? The normal uh, chlamydia or the normal gonorrhea. Them gal has gone f way too far, some of them. So it's either man them's gonna rask lot, protect their self, by stop looking at... Because look, look online. When you look online, all you see is pretty pictures. Do you think pretty pictures mean... Yes, bro, we're, we're going to definitely wrap that up in the new year for sure. Yeah, when I get back from um, Morocco, I'll we'll sort out that for real. We got Alan Brando, my brother, my dupes. Yeah, when it comes to... Man, them looking for gal on Instagram, internet, and them something that you are putting yourself in danger, Bridget. Yeah? Cool, Mark Official, big up yourself, my family. You're putting yourself in danger. Girls are, are either going to do one of a few things. See? You got girls that check their self, that go to clinic, that check their self and know that they're clean woman. Those type of women don't put their self all about the place. Those type of women, you do not find them in every rascal art dance hall. You don't find them in every club. You don't see them in every bar. Okay, they're prestige type of women. Then you got another type of set of women or ladies that are out there. That they're out every night. They're trying to get the most attention from everybody. Um, they don't go and check themselves at the fucking clinic. They do have random partners. They do randomly have one night stands. Yeah. And nobody ain't checking each other. No one ain't checking their self, nothing. Tunika, I need to check you still, my sister. Bear loving her. Yeah? No one ain't checking nothing. Everyone's just having a nice time. Yeah? Man, am I looking for girls on Instagram? Instagram, do you know where these girls come from? The man them that's got a name, the man them that's got a, a status or a title or whatever you want to call that shit, you don't even know sometimes, nine times out of ten, somebody sent these loose girls them to you. You think that you've just, yeah, man, my girl's got breasts and tattoo and one bag of thing. Bro, we're in some serious times where people are going to use anything that is easily manipulative. Anything that somebody can manipulate, they're going to use that against you, brethren. They're going to use that against you, my friends. You like gal? They will send a gal for your bad man. Yesterday they had a girl they sent a girl for me yesterday. I'm gonna show you because I don't talk without talking my own Ross Clark revelations. You know? A girl what I know over 30 odd blood clot, yes. Message my phone, say yeah, she would like me for come check her. She don't message me in normal on a normal. But it's cool. We reply, yo, I go on. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If, uh, you know, I got this guy on but yeah, if you're free tomorrow, come link me, whatever. I said, yeah. it's all right, cool. Watch the play. Tomorrow far would me I get text about uh yeah well you know if you can come check me by ten o'clock. Uh, uh come check me by seven o'clock, sorry, my mistake. Come and check me by seven o'clock the latest because it's been a long day and I'm thinking, hold on. Now those people that know me know that I got shit going on in the background with niggas that think they can touch me, do shit to me, or any of the above. I know to myself. Nothing ain't happening like that. Anyone got bad intentions for me, I've got worse intentions for you. Anybody, name name all the names under the fucking hat. I couldn't care which name you bring out the hat. Any one of them got bad intentions for me, I've got worse pussy clout intentions for you. And that's how the pussy clout thing go. The girl's telling me about, oh, I imagine I ain't replied to none of the texts. Oh yeah, can you get, get here by 7 o'clock? Or, oh, 8 o'clock by the latest? Or, then again, 9 o'clock the latest because, you know, after that, I said, bomb clock, you know, I don't, I don't reply no text. So till the point, the girl sent me back a next text saying, raw. I sent you bare messages. And bear in mind, I was on the phone to somebody. So, you know, when someone's calling you and you press, I'll call you back. Say, nah, you sent you all these texts, you're not replying. No, no, no reply. That means that you ain't, you're not gonna, you're not gonna, I, I take it that you're not coming or something to that effect. Yeah. I, I take the fact that you've, you sent me a call me back, I'll call you back text. 
as disrespectful. I've known you over 30 years, Patrick. Yeah, I'm done. So me, I said, but well, I'm about year 30, you know, about 20 past eight, and I'm saying, this sounds like someone that's fucking desperate. Number one, me now look your crutches, my girl. I'm not looking your crutches. I know you're connected to the same people that don't like me. I know that you are a vulnerable young lady, and I know that these pussyos will use you. Thinking that I'm a low-life pussy or looking crutches every day and everywhere, I'm just going to jump to the occasion of some girl looking to give me a bit of crutches. Are you stupid? More fool, all of you dickheads. All of you dickheads. And I know the culprit as well because I know who's connected to the girl. More fool, all of you. The girl could have only said, I've known you for 30 years and I'm done. There would never be another conversation between me and this girl ever. Why? Because you was found out by your own actions. The higher the monkey climb is the higher the monkey climb and it exposes its body all. So make them go on. Every single one that thinks they, they can get me in a location where... Because that's the only time these dickheads have got strength. The only time my enemies have got strength is when they lawyer you into a location where you're trapped. That's what they're good at. That's what we're good at. I come from the same batch. So I know the Mets. Keep telling man, keep fucking trying and keep fucking yourself because there comes a day when everyone have to face their judgment. My brothers, my sisters, stop checking these little lame gal them on social media. They mean man no fucking good. Half of them don't have no shit and don't have no window to blood clot. That shit out. Uh, uh. Enough of them don't have a, a decent lifestyle. Enough of them, if you go match up with them, or you go drag them around the world and it's an extra luggage and all of this. Listen, you see, meeting the right people, you have to meet the right people. You can't butt them on social media because you're not meeting anybody on social media. You're just seeing what they're putting in front of you for you to like. Some things, multiple choice, you might like this, you might not like that. But you might not, the penny might not drop to what you're supposed to see. Man them. The only way to get the man them to, 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 to certain locations and areas is by using some of these low life Yell them that ain't got a pot to piss in, a window for dash it out of, no fucking guidance, no fucking direction in life, not got no father in their life, pick up all sorts of little pissing tail, use them off the road, and think they can set up your life. London Open TV, big up yourself, my Jenna, 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 Jenna. Yeah? Yeah, real life thing. Cause most people don't get it, brother. I was just watching something online, I said, wow. A young Instagram model, 27 years old. She catch blood clot AIDS and she didn't even know she caught it when she was 17. When she was living in, in New York, sleeping rough. You understand? Getting fucking tattoos done by used needles by other people. Come on. So there's these things that we need to wake up to and be... Be mindful of, Bretchen. Be mindful of this shit. It's not just the fact that, oh, she could have all these diseases, but the chick could be setting you up. Is your life worth a bit of pussy? Ain't your life worth more than pussy, Bretchen? And the man them me I talk to, you know? Because the man them that's at risk, and it's the man them that's, you get me, being targeted. So I'm talking to my brothers near and pussy clock far. Is your blood clot life not worth more than the girl them's crutches? And half of them, remember this, you know? Girl them can go blood clot Brazil and all these places. Turkey and all these places. For do up their breasts and body and legs and all these fucking things. But not one of them girl there, as much as their Instagram models have never gone to Turkey, I said so they're going to go and do up their pussy. All of their pussy is the same old pussy that they fucked up from how many blood clot years ago that he has looked as good as they look. I just see them dead pussy where I get, brother. Is it worth it, my friends? Is it worth it, my brothers? Wake up. These Instagram chicks, some of these Instagram faces are fake as fuck. Man them that have them in their corner, use them because they've already turned them out. So they use them to, to lawyer good people like you. Good people like myself. The same way they tried to lawyer me to Oval last night. Yeah? And a part of me wanted to still go down there. You know what was funny to me? 
When I came off my phone call, I come off my phone call, right? I said, let me call this fucking mad girl. Who this girl texting like that? Phone the girl, the girl's phone's going to gift gaff voicemail. Now, hold on. One of two things is going on here because I'm not small-minded, so let me just open it up a bit more. One of two things is happening. Either this girl was looking piece of wood, yeah, and she tried to have a multiple choice again, you know, like called me thinking or text me thinking she can get me there or, you know, and if he doesn't turn up, then at least I've got a, you know what I mean, a secondary cocky. Maybe that's what was going through her head, but to someone like me, that's suspect. Or it's the fact that you were trying to lawyer me there for the friends that you know we mutually have and that don't like me. Those people would gladly use your spot. Remember, you don't have no picnic in your yard. You don't have no picnic in your yard. That's why you message me to tell me you ain't got no you in your yard. You've just come from funeral and all this stuff. You see, anyone think that they're smart with me. And if it's man, woman or child think they're going to set me up for dead. Remember, I'll kick down your blood clot anywhere I see you. Remember that pussy clot. And I don't give a fuck who you may be. I don't care who you have around you. There's no so when you try a thing and you get found out. I miss you anyway, miss you. I mean, I kick down your blood clot, dirty girl and dirty boy. I ain't a pussy wall where I feel like I had that kind of party there. I'm a good person. I mean, nobody no harm. But if you mean me harm, I'm going to double the arm that you mean me. I'm going to force it upon you. Trust me, we're deep, we, we will get deep into this jungle thing if you want to get to the jungle justice. Man them, save your life. And save your rascal like goods and save your fucking, your, 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 your belongings. Stay in your yard. Enough time, Monday in them yard, you know, I kick back our child and move, you know. See? I kick back our child and move with me people and get all two texts and, you know, look a bird call them, try call you out. It's done gone after hours. Man's phone not supposed to be ringing. I don't live that lifestyle where girl can just message me after hours and, oh yeah, baby, we only link up. I don't live that life. You got to call me in the daytime because it's about business. And if it's not about business, then you better be naffing off. Do you understand? So I don't live that lifestyle where you can just call me and I'm just going to jump in my car and drive up the road. I'm a spiritual man. I don't jump in my car and drive anywhere unless my spirit says time to go. So big up to you, Leah, that thought you were smart yesterday. God go with you and may the most I guide your steps and your journey because before every action, there is a reaction and there will be a chain of reaction for any pussy that won't get involved because I am a truthful guy and I'm a man of justice and I'm a man of discipline. <laughs> Who these people think they're fucking with? If I was a guy that they could get through girls, they would have got me how many years ago? If I was a man that they could have got through girls, it would have got me a long time. They've sent many girls to try and draw me out. Many, I know one or two. Enough, them draw, them send for, try draw me out. If I was a, a slippery guy that just care about crutches, rather get the light, let me fly, go in car. Me dead. That, oh no, 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 me no business about woman. There's enough girl out there that like me. I know that. I'm a likable man. But I'm not going to just overdo my thing just because everyone likes me. I just want to jump up and spread all, all over the place. No, because I know that I'm a valuable person that is, that's got so much to me. A lot of women would love to have me in their fucking corner. I'm not in everyone's corner. I'm not that kind of guy. I'm good. I know the demons. I know the setups. I know the tricks. I know the women that see me as just some, you know, some little title thing. Oh yeah, my baby father's killer pee. I got them baby mothers already. <laughs> I don't need no more of them kind of gal there. You understand those were mistakes by accept, you know, some little mistakes that I got to live with. <laughs> Why would I want to add to those mistakes and have more mistakes? No, we learn from our mistakes and we move forward and we try and iron out where it went wrong. You know, so that's why I'm humble in my corner. I'm humble in, in my career. I don't, I'm not hyping to be around, be an artist and performing. No, I'm humble. When I get my time, I'm out there. Yovers, I'm not pushing up myself under no gal. Me not, you know how much gal try to set me up already? Gal try to set me up because them are, them are my brethren, them blood clot, baby mother, them and think they're smart. I don't understand, I don't play them games. So, like I say, to my brothers that's out there, if you're smart, 
left the social media girl them alone. They will either fuck your shit up when it goes bad because you met them on social media. Social media is the new tool to fuck people's lives up. So when you meet them on social media, it's all good at first. But when it goes all pear shake, my friend, understand that this is where they're gonna come to air all of the fuck. You get me? This is where they're gonna come to diss up your blood clot on this same social media. Do you understand what I'm saying? So know what you lot are doing. That's all I'm saying to my people, you know, my brothers. No, don't check these stinking dirty gal them on social media. They don't mean my no pussy clot good. Yeah, enough of them. Enough of them. Enough gal online. Enough of them. Enough. I'm gonna delete a whole heap of people as well. Enough people you might even see on my page today. They will be deleted by tonight. There's enough people don't trust them. I don't trust shit. About what have you missed? No, about what have you missed, my sister, man? It's just what's going on. There's too much going on. You know them as well, Ma Ma Marnie, Mar Marissa. You know how much fear gal them they're on the social site. You know how much gal them they're online. I set up the man them. You know all these things, Marissa. You know, because you come from the same spots we come from. So, you know, these are the things I'm highlighting. Because last night, yesterday, a girl tried to do the same thing to me. And I'm letting all females know it ain't that kind of fucking party. And I'm not a woman beater. But you see, for any woman, any woman that thinks they're going to set me up, I will kick up your blood clot in your crutches. Publicly. No fear. Don't care about backlash. Don't care about counsel. No pussy can't counsel this. I'm not one of them. I'm not signed to no one that can counsel me. I don't depend on these people like that. No. I'm a man of truth, rights and justice. You step on my toe, I will fuck you up. Stay out of my fucking way. And I've always been that way. I've been the nicest man as long as you stay out of my way. I've been the nicest man as long as you don't fuck with me. But when you fuck with me, don't expect to be the only nice guy over here. Stinking crutches, get them. So look at dirty crutches. Some girl will need to go sort out their life. Go and clean up their yard. Go, go, go dig up the little dirty nasty drawers them where them have each up behind them sofa them and hand at them bed and all them something them girl if you go do them something there and don't pray good people pick me like me because I will I'll listen yeah that's what these people them think they're doing they think they can draw me out like that like that level there they don't understand I soon catch you and all of you you're paying to do what you're doing I soon catch all of you I soon catch all of you man woman and child all of you we feel like you do we are do like I'm ahead of the game. That's why I'm still here smiling. That's why I still look fresh. I ain't got no scar up in my face like Scar. I ain't got no scar up in my face like Kevin. I ain't got no half a nose dropping off like them, like some old regurgitating Michael Jackson. No, I'm here. I'm good. Yeah, it's war. And it's war till I'm dead. Test me. I bring anyone. Send anyone. I will never back down. From you, Kevin. You pussy old Kevin. And all your little friend them that you think you're paying. I will never back down. I'm a bad boy for all of you. All the man them that's even got name. I'm a bad boy for you. You know it as well. Ah, it makes me sick. It makes me sick. Half of the man them, look. Let me give you some revelations. Half of the man them that's got bad boy name. That's got an old school gangster bad boy name. Enough man them online can testify to this shit. Enough of the man them that come up under some gangster name that the community is in fear of. They're only bad because what they done is that they sniffed a bit of coke or they bun a bit of wagger and then they went out and done a bag of fuckery. And because of that, they got a name. I didn't get named by sn sniffing coke or bunning wagger, bro. Or smoking poo-poo, bro. No. Everything I fucking done was level fucking headed, bro. You fucking mad. I never done nothing under no drink, alcoholic beverage or no fucking drugs, bruv. Everything I've done is because you troubled me and level-headedly, I come and dealt with you. There's a fucking difference. You ex-crackhead guys think you got something on me. I guarantee you, your bones are weak. I guarantee you, your heart is weak. I guarantee you, your mind is weak. I guarantee you, your brain cells are weak. I guarantee all of the weakness of what you think you've got strength for me for. One clot in your head and you most probably collapse and dead. So carry on testing people like me. I don't care who, what name, what gang, what background, nothing. I've not troubled no one. All these pussyos, all I've done is help them. And they've got nothing but evil for me. So let me show you right now. All these people that's got evil for me, I've got evil of things for you. All of you. That's why you got to walk with a hundred man. And I keep saying to you, I don't care if you got a hundred man. You're going to need more than a hundred man. I'm still going to come to the dance on my ones and lock off the dance where the dance is ram. 
Cause I mean everything I say and I've said everything I mean and I live it. Pussies. I'm not frightened. I just see that you think you can use girls. You can't use girls on me. You can't use girls on me. If I feel me for fuck the one girl for the fucking five years till me catch you, then I dat me, I got no pussy. You feel like you don't can catch me with girl? If it mean I don't fuck no girl for five years till I catch your pussy, you think I girl alone? You don't think you got me like that? None of you people know me. None of you know me. The same way I put 100% into music, put 100% into doing my podcast, my godcast, put 100% into doing clothing, what I'm doing. I put 100% into everything I do. I put 100% into taking you off the fucking earth as well, pussy. So you lot keep doing what you're doing, testing the waters, because I sing music just for the sake of singing songs, innit? And I'm a pussy, like Archer said. Oh, yeah, killer pussy, killer that. Yeah, I'm a pussy. Test me then. Since I'm a pussy, test me then. And that goes for every one of you that think I'm a pussy. I'm a trigger happy pussy. So test me and see something. I hope somebody reminded you and warned you that part. I hope they warned you that part. I am a trigger happy pussy. Since I'm a pussy, yeah, I'm a pussy. I'm a trigger happy pussy that will empty it, bake it on you. I'll bake it on you, pussy. Fucking idiots. I don't know what I'm to some man. Think I'm out here just making music and that's it. I'm doing so much great things and I'm humble. And I, and I like my life. And I love what I'm doing. Now so big up yourself. I love what I do musically. I love what I do in the background. I like making people, inspiring people to do great things. I love doing them things there, bruv. That's what I live for. These little fucking fish want to be out here trying to pay girls to lawyer me to their house. The same way you got me in a drugs house the last time and tried to beat me to death, right? You and your little dead brother, Andy, yeah? The same way your little dead brother, little Andy Rascal, lawyered me into a little crack house, yeah? Thinking it was some drug deal, drug deal we're going to go and do. And you like, beat me and Rascal Ninja for over an hour in that yard when I was 13 years old, yeah? You don't think you're trying to do the same thing again now? I will murder you and every blood clot one at Uno. Every single one. I'm not hiding and talking because you see what? Everybody knows what's taking place and everyone wants to sit silent and play stupid. I'm not playing stupid. I'm not playing dunce. I'm not playing blind bat. I am aware of everybody's actions, where everybody stands, what side of the fence people are sitting on. When they see me, they just smile and, are oh, you right? Yeah, yeah, fam, it's all love. It's all love because it has to be all love because you don't know what I'm coming with. You don't know what my heart's on, bro. You just know I'm a good you. So as long as you come with that goodness, I ain't going to bring that negative thing to you. That's what you know about me. Don't overstep the mark, man. That's what I'm saying to my people, please. Watch out for these little snakes. They're out there. and They're working hard. Yeah, Kevin's been trying to pay niggas 10 grand to pitch me. 10 bags. You're going to have to triple that money. Gazizzle that money, pussy. You prick. And come and do shit to me my, yourself. Whatever you want to do to me, do it yourself. Don't let me come over to 47. Again, I make you have to phone your next door neighbor. Pussy all that, man. I'm tired of people, man. I just want this over and done with. I want whatever niggas think they want to do, come and do it. You all know where I live. You all know where I live. I ain't, I'm not off the ends. I'm on the ends. You all know where I, you know where I rest my head. Come and lurk. Come and do what you're doing, bro. Come on, so I can leave a body on my strip. Come and do do what you think you're trying to do so I can leave your body on my fucking road. You people think I'm playing games with you. I'm here to defend what is mine's. Not a pussy for no nah, man. Everyone's got a name. Yeah, I respect one and two names out there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but we've all got a fucking name. So if you don't respect my thing, I don't respect your thing. And I don't care who that pussy or maybe. Yeah, it's respect for respect or disrespect for it. Yours is the thing. Everyone's got it. Everyone can rise it. Everyone can clean it. It's who cleans it first, who gets there first, and who get touched first. Don't think no one's shook out here, bruv. Dickheads, little pussy them. Using little scatty girls like fucking Leah. Leah is a fucking vulnerable chick. Anyone that knows me and's heard me speaking from Facebook days back in the day when I was first talking, I said this from years ago. They only go for vulnerable people that they can manipulate them to do things. Yeah. 
I've never walked with no one. You don't see me walk with no. I can name the man them that you usually see me with. I don't even have to, because you know them, my people. You don't see me with none of them. You don't see me check them. You don't see me stand up with them. You don't see me park up. You don't see me around nobody. Why? Let's get to why. Is it not because I don't need people, Bridget? And is it not because I don't trust people, Bridget? And is it not because I don't want co-defendants in my case? When it's time to drop a body and bust a case, I don't need no external people them talking about it went like this, it went nothing, never got like nothing. If me not talk, no dog, no bark. There's something there. So big up to Kevin and all these hundred man them running up and down behind him. Pussy them. The wall are uno a pussy. Yeah? Uno not defend nothing from Andy Drop. And uno I walk up and down like uno are bad people. I circle pop bricks than every fucking minute. You lot are pussies. Come to my house, you don't know where I live. That's why you've been sending police to my yard. But I'm the informer. But you lot been sending police to my house. But I'm the informer. But I'm the one that's been driving to your house and pulling up and telling you pussy I was come outside today's the day, pussy. But you want to go online, chat shit, and say, oh, uh, as soon as the police drove off, Killer P pulled up and then Killer P was up the road chatting to the police. When? When? Pussy old Kevin. When? Butty old Kevin. When have I ever spoken to police? Somebody told me. Somebody told me. Anyone see me with police is because I'm getting arrested. Somebody told me any different. Somebody show me any different. Actually, somebody show the people any different. Otherwise, shut the fuck up. I'm not your toy. I'm not your little, your little runner or your, so, your little soldier. I will kick down you and your little friend, them, Kevin. Don't play with me. You've already drawn cards already, so you know where it's gone. It's way gone past next stage and next stage. You might as well deal with me like how you dealt with all the rest of them and them in the darkness. You might as well put on your balaclava and come and deal with me like how you've dealt with the rest of them and them in the darkness, bro. Because you're going to die. You're playing with the wrong energy. You were dead pussy. And that that's what I'm saying to you. I'm putting it out there clearly. Stop fucking with good people. Your old man should have told you that it's going to backfire soon, pussy. That's all me, I say. Stop checking these dead out Instagram chicks that don't mean no one no good. They don't even mean their self no good. Yeah? If you're looking at a girl, go out a road, walk until you, your spirit tells you, say, right, that girl look good, you know? Hello, miss. Um, are you spoken for? No. And then you go from there, brother. This fuckery online eh? Dead. Call me, I see how people with dead panda something yeah, over this thing here. Eh? Trust me, man. I'm pissed off, bro. Fuck the world. And fuck what people think. Fuck people's opinions. You get me? Everyone's fake as fuck, bro. People are fake as fuck. Instead of people standing up and saying, rah, it's true, you know. Man will stand over there with the pussy them just to look like the extra numbers and be a part of a team of some fuckery. I'm not with no fuckery. I don't need you for my gun for bus pussy. I don't need you for boy skull for bus over there. I don't need you for boy jelly bag for bus over here. So just know that. And that's why most of these niggas are scarce. Because they know that about me. When I speak, I mean it. I don't hide and talk. I've seen many men them on the and they've had it. Yeah? They've had it. Yeah, they've had it. They get bad up all left, right, and center. No one can't chat to me. Cause I see you. I see you. I see you. I see your plans. I see what you're up to. I know what you're on. You ain't getting me like that. Before you get me, I'm coming for you. And usually when I come for you, you're not ready, are you? Yeah. You're not ready. So go and talk out a road. Killer P's an informer. Killer P work for police. Uh, yeah, I guarantee no from they shot up his yard. Killer P started working for police. You're a pussy, Kevin. I know from the minute your brother died, you worked for police. Let's get the story straight. From the minute Andrew Belfort dropped, you started working for police. You and your brother. And every fucking year ever since, you've been waiting for a police update on your brother's death. Talk the thing then, pussy. Talk the thing, them pussy. Talk the thing, them pussy. Anyone that wah-wah me is man them that used to be bad man them. They're not bad no more. 
Otherwise, you'll be at my fucking front door. Pussy. Chatting shit on Elijah's page. Don't act up. You ain't no gangsters for me. No, you're not. You have to talk online. You have to. Yeah, you have to talk. I pull up outside your yard, pussy. If I was an informer, I was a pussy. If I was a shook one, my BMW, my Mercedes, and my next Bimmer, and my Audi would have never pulled up outside your yard. Pussy. True man's realer than you. A man's ready for you. And all you can do is come out your house when you got a man them with you. If you don't have man them with you, you can't come out your house. It's the same trait your older brother, little pussy or Rogers got. If I'm not there to walk him out of his house, him can't come out time yard. So we know you. Stop using these vulnerable young ladies to try and draw me out. It ain't gonna work. The any day, name day that you feel like you got the strength for me and that you're my bad man today, you come to my house because you know where I live. Tap on my door, press my ring doorbell, and say, Pussy, oh, your, ta your time today, you know? Come outside. You see how quick I fly outside and stab up your blood clot. Yeah, and I don't, I don't promote them things, but I tell you, Pussy, you will see how quick I bust the door and stab up your blood clot. I wouldn't say a word to you. I wouldn't say a blood clot word to you. I, I bust the door and stab up your pussy as, as the door busts, as the door open. As the door open, it's beer star, star feed you with it. You feel you can come round my piece and chat tough and bring badness. My front door. You really ain't done that. You ain't really ain't done the the, 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 the the research. You really ain't checked the stats, bro. And big up to the man them that know. They know Patrick. They know Patrick's a real you, brother. Listen, I don't think you people understand what you lot are on my page talking about. And I don't think you lot understand who you're talking to. I'm not here for no one to tell me about don't go jail people and all this stuff. You see, in life, you got to stand for something or you got to fall for anything. You see, most of you people online, you lot just talk. I ain't on talking. Nobody threatens my family and gets away with it. You cross a silver line that you were dead for. Nobody threatens my mum and gets away with it. You were dead. You just cross a next silver line, pussy hole. Yeah? And nobody posts these pictures of my picnic them on social media and disrespecting my daughters them and think they're getting away with it. You were dead again, pussy. Say, so you see, Allah Uno, we are talking about don't go jail, how kill it, don't do this, bless. Listen to the context of what's being said first before Uno have a little blood clot opinion, please. I never come on here for that. Manners and respect every time, same way. Yeah? I know it's coming from a good place. But you see, when people cross line, there ain't nothing else, Bridget. Overstand that. It's life and death. My life in this, in this period, you know, too many attempts have been taken off of my life. Nine times they've tried to kill me in the last five years. For most of you that don't blood clot, no. The same pussy them that's been trying to kill me, do you think I'm going to want them to live? Oh yeah, live long. All the, you know, more, more life, my brother. More life, my brother. Y'all got dead like your brother. I feel like I'm some little soft pussy, all I ain't. I'm not. I don't come from that. I'm a good you. Because I come from the trenches where I've learned. I've learned from going through the stages of life. No man, not this my people, them. I feel like you're bigger than my people, them. We would dirt your blood clot. Yeah. The same way you want to dirt me. So the feeling's mutual, okay? Okay. Man that wanna be like me, huh? Man that can MC but can't spit bars. Man will claim them can't spit bars but you're not on tune. You're, you're hating on me because I've got a million songs out there. The world knows who I am as Killer P when I'm at yet pan me. Hate then? It's not my fucking fault, is it? Keep hating your cunt. You think I fucking care? My hard work when Uno a sniff coke and I take blood clot drugs. We there I guide the youth them and I blood clot spend with money in a studio and I drive and I put petrol in a wicked car. I drive a country and I perform and I build with blood clot foundation. And Uno want bad mind that pussy. Uno never do nothing for no one a picnic, but Uno want bad mind me. Wait the fuck up. I don't respect enough of these pussy hoes, them. Enough people rate badness out of fear. I don't rate bad man, them. I don't rate bad man. I prefer rate a geek. I prefer respect a geek. Because he knows 
more about life and he's trying to achieve more out of life than for watch people want to kill man where you grow with, want to inveigle in a, a mash up people life, you little pussy. He's a pussy. Yeah. Ah, you little friend them, they're pussies as well. They've always been pussies. You can, you know, my, if you buy Gucci this year, Louis Vuitton last year, fucking uh, 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 um, glorious gangster next year, fucking hood rich the year after that, you're still a pussy in a bad people clothes. It don't matter if you just start by Ross Clark. It ain't no unity, mighty shot. Come off my page if it's that. Bad man. Fuck unity, bro. You know, yes, I'm gonna depend that today, brother. I ain't on no unity with no enemies, bro. I ain't on no, no fucking unity with enemies, bro. You think we're all people? No, we're not all people, bro. Some of us are demons and enemies and working for the other side. And I'm not siding with them, my brother. There's good and there's evil. I don't sit with evil, bro. I sit with good people, bro. Yeah, too much evil heads out there, bro. Too much evil heads out there, bro. I'm not siding with them. I don't want to unite with them. I'm in war with them, my family. Yeah, I'm in war with them, my family. That's the difference. Everyone wants to be friends with everyone. And I'm not on no get along gang with no one. Everyone got fall up under your blood clot, y'all. Me no business. Enough people don't rate me. I see that. I don't want your ratings. I never did. It wasn't your ratings that got me where I am. If I was depending on your ratings, I'd still be on the block, standing on the block, selling a couple of drawers or mostly shutting some fucking Bobby or some Whitney. You yeah, understand? I'm not doing that. I'm selling clothes. Selling music. <laughs> you I don't sell people dreams. Yeah. Fuck. You don't have to believe in or nothing. You have to know things, brother. Yeah. You have to know things. You don't have to believe nothing. Belief is ignorance. I don't believe in shit. I know things, my brother. See, when we're giving out information, we have to know how we're giving it out, Bridget. Some of us are far ahead, brother. I don't believe nothing. I understand that. I don't believe in shit, you know. I know things, my brother. I know my ancestors, them are out there guiding me, my brother. I understand Mother Earth is definitely in action and working. I know my father's up there, so call my father sunshine every blood clot, yeah. You of us. So it's not about belief. Belief is ignorance, my brothers and sisters. Go and look up the word and see the meaning of that word there and tell people, say, you believe in them again. You understand what I'm saying to you? Me not believe in them something there. Belief. No, I know things or I don't know things. Things I don't know, I want to research, read about, look about and live about and get to know. I don't do a belief though. No. Belief is an illusion. Make you think, oh yeah, 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 it is this when it's really not that, bro. We have to know that because we're grown. We're old. We're old enough to know better now. So we have to do that. Do better now. Fuck it. We're fucking regurgitating shit that they've brainwashed us to believe. Oh, we're talking all this jud, jud this and jud that, but we're still in a, this fucking illusion of belief. <laughs> spiritualism when we wake up fuck religion when we get to the spiritual side of life you when you're at one with the most die and the spirit tells you when to rascal make a move then you know that you're great then you know you're unstoppable enough of us just met move because our friend says yeah how come we got and you already forgot no you can't get me that way because until the ancestors tell me to move i don't get up out my chair that's the difference. That's the difference between knowing things and believing things. And we have to learn from each other, you know, because we're not wrong. Sometimes we have to just learn from each other and just get right. There's nothing wrong with that still. You get me? Big man thing. We have to just know better, Bridget. Belief is dead. All of what we've learned all over 40 odd years and belief and, bro, it's not about belief, it's about knowing. I have to know this is going on. I have to know that's the way to deal with it. I have to know these are the procedures or the steps that I have to take to move forward with it. I can't believe that. Because that means I'm going to have to take on what somebody else has told me and believe in it. Well, I've got to do my research to know it. I ain't misleading me in this world, bro. No boy, no girl. No girl, no boy, wretched. I've lived. Enough people's only read. They've read a lot. There's a difference to, between people that read a lot and people that's lived a lot. Enough people coop up in a them house, I read a bag of books. I think you can come to someone like me 
and tell me where me live all the way I read about me live it enough in our real time wake up man we live brethren so that's why when we live we can teach each other things I remember one hand can't clap but I'm way far gone from anyone to tell me about belief I don't believe in nobody yeah man Believe. Belief is a weak word for any leader. Belief is a weak word for any leader. A leader can't use that. We can't follow someone that's supposed to be leading us into a oh, well, well, I believe if we jump on this boat, you know, we can get to, you know, the other side, you know, we can get to the other side, not knowing. If the fucking boat's got holes in the fucking floor of it, or if it's been checked over, or if it's been MOT'd, or if it's been any of the above. No, but we just look at a boat and we just, oh, we believe we can jump on this boat and get from A to Z. Is it really? When I went to Croatia, I jumped on a boat and said to the boatman, yo, rent me this boat. I want to I wanna go for a drive. I don't care. I just want to drive the boat for about half an hour. The man charged me a fee. I said, cool. He said, you want to go by this? I said, you mad. I want you to be in the boat. I need you in the boat. If the boat, if the boat run out of petrol, where am I going? Hmm? If the car, if the thing broke down, am I going to, it's your boat. You, you mad. You think I'm going to jump in the people, them thing talking about, I believe I'm going to drive out this and come back. Get the hell out of here, man. We have to know things. We know how life is. Life hasn't treated us so well. We know life comes with a lot of curveballs. So we have to work with what we know. We can't switch what you know for what you believe. That's like switching sure for unsure. Mother always told me don't do that. You can't left sure for unsure. So you're sure about this car. This car's been starting for you every fucking day. Nothing wrong with it, but you could, you want to sell that car you're all of a sudden. Cause you want to buy a next car where your friends say that car looks sick, you know. But you're unsure if that car's going to serve you the same way this car served you, my friend. But it's all good. You sell that car, yeah. you go buy that car, yeah. and you are living at the garage with that car there. Why? Because you're not sure, and the car hadn't been guaranteed. You get me? There was no guarantee with the vehicle. Don't leave sure for unsure. Left a woman where rascal I check for you. For your woman where just like you. Left a man where blood clot love you. For your man where just like you. You're leaving sure for unsure. Be careful, man. Life is serious, Brenton. You have to wake up from these fucking illusions. Make us think that we're doing the right thing and we're good. We're not good. We're in danger. You have to know when danger is lurking. And you have to know when people have been sent to you. Definitely, the, the moral of this whole conversation is basically know when a woman's been sent to the man them I'm talking. Not to the woman them. Big up to the good women them on my page, cause I know enough good women on my page. And I don't, I'm not talking about you, but we have to single out those that are out there that are doing the dirty work them. For you look who dirty carna boy them, where I keep up them fuckery. You others? So to my brothers them out there, be careful of these Instagram model chicks that man them look like. They want to pick up one little Barbie tonight, or you want to get through to one little Barbie. Careful, cause enough of these Barbies have already been contracted to take out most of the man them in the community. Look. Let me show you something. There is a thing called population control taking place right now underneath our nose. Every single way possible, this is how it's going to unfold, right? So that means the women them that are out there that are that have got a price that will take a small change to set up a man and honey trap a man. Why do you think we done films like Honey Trap? Is to wake the brothers up to these things. Not just with little girls. There's big men and big women out there doing the same shit because sometimes the women can't get a decent job. They're sitting on benefits. They've got children. They've got no baby father there. They pick up one little rascal at Roadman that's doing one and two things. He's got her doing certain things she wouldn't normally do, but she's down for it because the cocky sweeter. So now she's willing to set up whoever she can set up because this man is a little robber man and that's what he does. And this is what he needs to feed his habit. And you understand, you got to know there's people that will just sell out the whole thing. Right now, you got man them that are undercover smokers. Let me show you your meds. That I, I'm not stupid to nothing. I see everything as it is. Undercover smokers rolling around with clean-hearted niggas. Clean man them that are making their money, going through, doing their thing, not troubling nobody, brethren. These local man them that are hiding and smoking, 
taking food from air, robbing Peter to pay Paul. All of a sudden, rob Peter and rob Paul. Now they're fucked because they know they need to pay back what they need to pay back. They're looking at you, who's supposed to be their brethren, that don't know that these people are smoking under the quiet. Saying, boy, I know my man makes his money, and you know? I know my man makes back his pee, and you know? I know my man does his thing. But you know what? I'm robbing my boy, you know. I'll, I, I'll even help him make back the money later on, but I'm robbing my boy, bro. I'm robbing him. Fuck it. Man will set up Donny, rob Donny for the bag for whatever he's got, just so that they can feed their habit, pay back whoever they pay back, because they know their life's in danger, because they fucked up with the wrong fucking dealer. Yeah? All of these underground, underground, nasty fucking behavior and traits. I don't want no part of it. But not just to say that, you can also just become a victim of it just because you're connected to someone that is still living a part of that lifestyle. Got their self caught up, still connected to you, so they come and you're the you're the you're just the next prey, innit? You know how the thing got. Keep your eyes open, man. Know about these chicks that get sent in your DMs. You think Chris girls are just in your fucking DMs for no reason. Oh, yeah. Oh, she likes me. Oh, yeah, is it? Girls don't like niggas, bro. Man's an artist, bro. People like my music. You think everyone likes me? No one don't like me. People like my music, though. They dance to it every fucking weekend. Doesn't mean that they like me, bro. Kick that out of your head. That's just your ego talking to you, making you think the world likes you. Maybe if the world actually got close enough to you to know what you're really like, personality-wise... They'll run a fucking mile, bro. They mostly never play your music again as well. And that's a fact. And that's a reality. <laughs> you know what I mean? Man don't have to believe that. That's something I know. Okay. So be careful out here, man. Kazi, Kazi, big up yourself, man. As a respect every time, man. Um, here what it is, yeah. It's not even about the pretty part of life, yeah? Because, hey, what, man's, man's always grown up. When my head was picky and I didn't have money, I had pretty girls. My school had pretty girls, bruv. Don't get it twisted. I'm just, I'm just saying, like, now that we've got things in our lives where we work hard, we're trying to achieve great things, we, we're always trying to raise the bar year to year, we're trying to achieve new things and greater things, right? You're going to have more demons coming into your domain. You've got more people being sent to you to disrupt what you're doing. That's all I'm saying. Keep your eye open on these things. People might not want to listen to what I'm saying now. Somebody saved this life. Somebody record the life, save the life. I don't know if I'm going to save this life, to be fair. I might have to because the gems that are in this life needs to be fucking regurgitated. It needs to be shared. People need to fucking hear the shit. It's real. Mm? It's real. Bear narratives are being... People are pushing bare different funny little narratives out there. Like, yeah, this one. This one's funny. This one's a fish. This one's informer. This one's that. This one's this. Look, based on your livity, people already know who you are. If I was a fish, people be walking and talking that long time. If I was an informer, people be walking and talking that long time. If I was any of these pussy old things that people are out there talking online... They would have been saying that long time. You wouldn't be waiting for 2020, 2021, 2022, 2029 to be saying, oh, all of a sudden, Killer's a pussy. Oh, yeah, Killer was my family. He was like a family member, but he's a pussy. Oh, and... What? Either I'm a pussy or I'm family. You see, in the, in the early stage of this argument, I always said to my people online, they're trying to pay people to kill me. All of my road brothers, them, take the money. But no, you can't do me nothing. But go take their money, though. These were some of the brothers that actually went and took their money and thought they'll come online and diss me up and send out, like, bird calls. Like, man, then, when you see Killer P, yeah, don't do him nothing, you know, he's my family, same way, like, family still, but... Indirectly, you think I'm stupid? You think I'm stupid? Any game a man wants to play can be played twice. It's more dangerous when man's got money. I'm not broke. I'm not rich. But I, I, I can get I can get what I need. I can get what I need. It's not what you're fucking doing. I'm not scared of nothing. I'm scared of jail time. I'm scared of police. I'm scared of court, courthouse, court case. I'm scared of solicitors. I'm scared of CPS. I'm scared of none of that shit. I'm definitely not scared of my reflection. 
I know we bleed all the same. It's just really sad. Tell you what's up. What, what really hurts me is that it's sad that our brothers of where we come from and suffered with, suffered with the same people that want to kill us. You know, that's what hurts me. Suffered with those people. Broke bread with those people. When they talk, oh, they don't know me, don't know me. Yeah, we broke bread with those same little pussyholes that want to talk about they don't know, man, all of a sudden. Looked after their parents, took their parents shopping, brought their... You understand? We've done all of the above. All of a sudden, you want to kill me. You want to pay people in the community to kill me. You want to split the community in half. Let me show you something. You only have one life. My people, bear this in mind. You only have one life. People will either kill you in this world when they can't get along with you, or they'll set you up for you to kill yourself. They'll either make you end up killing your own characteristic, or they'll out be out there trying to kill your characteristic online. You see, when they try all these things and these things don't work, they put you in a position where you do it to yourself, where you self-destruct. I'm not that kind of person. See, I'm a very strategic person. As silly as they think I am and as stupid as they, they think I am, they know that I'm way skilled more than them. Because if it's taken you five years and you still can't hit me up, then you're not on your game. I haven't moved. I ain't made a, I ain't made a move to make a move on them like that. Because my intention isn't to really... You get me? Like, you guys say you want to do this and do that. Come then. Come on then. And let me show you what I do to you. That's my stance. You know, you don't see me outside their house no more. Like, parking up saying, Paul, say, oh, no, nah, done with that. That was in the early stage when you was getting to me. When everything that was going on in the background was getting to me, people. I was willing to kick off their door and stab up anyone that I saw in their house. Because it was getting to me. My people. They think they can use reverse psychology, use little dickheads in the community to get to me. No, man. I'm better than enough of the man that's got names. And I'm not talking about musical niggas. That's some low-level shit. I'm talking about the real niggas in the hood that really do their dirt, that really make blood spill and all them something there. I'm really gangster than enough of them because they hide behind their friends. And they can only do work when they're with their friends. I do work all by myself. I don't need one fucking friend to stand beside me. I don't need one friend to stand beside me. Not one friend, not one nigger, not one gunman, not one shooter, not one killy killy. All these pretty little road names niggas are calling to make their self feel like they're more. You know what I mean? Yeah, me, I'm a killy killy. You're a pussy about you and your killy killy. Why can't you do what you want to do? Why you need your killy killy? That's called holding hands. Hmm? That's what you call holding hands. I don't hold hands with no man. I don't even hold hands with gal. Pussy all. Fuck them boy they feel like. I'm a bad boy in real life before music. Big up to the ones that know that. Don't let me exercise it after. Please, I'm telling you. Because I'm a trigger happy person, bruv. If you don't know that, I'm not a hiding guy. I don't need to hide and do it. I don't need to hide and talk. I'm just saying don't fuck with me. And stop trying to use your little stupid, cr stinking crutches, gal, them, to set me up. Because it won't work. None of the man them can't set me up. If you want to do me something, like I keep saying, you know where I live, come to my fucking front door. <coughs> tap on the fucking front door. I'll answer and stab you up and give you what you fucking want on the spot. In front of my ring door doorbell and everything else. Because everything on my road has got ring doorbell. Pussy oh. So come up, yes, sir. And I'll, I'll dash where my old life for you, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna kill myself. I don't mind sitting down rubbing off time and busting my case to show them that it's self-defense. This is what they came here for. And I've been fighting this the whole time. I don't mind doing that. But you think I'm gonna walk out of the road and make you little pussy or what? Put your hands on me. What? Make you and your friend and wet me up out of the road. You're mad before I do that. I'll do 30 years for you and all of you. Enough for you not smiling. Yeah, killer. Yeah, kills and. Smiling, you lot don't mean me no good. You lot hate me as much as most of my enemies hate me, which is cool. But you lot can't tell me that to my face because you know I'll bust my gun in your face. You know that I'll stab up your pussy hole. Simple as that.
You get me? Everyone else wants to hide and run behind and go on like they're the goodest guy and the best guy. I'm not the best guy. I'm the realest guy. I will tell you where you stand. I will show you where you stand. I'm the realest guy. I'm not going to hide and do it. Smile in your face, stab you in your back. I'm not going to do that. Not like these little pussies. Come round you and gain what they can and then go round next set of man them and chat you. Like, oh yeah, they're bad, they're bad man them because they got vo vibes cartels voice. That's not me. I actually do work in the, in the in real time and real life. I don't beg anyone for anything. I give what I've got. I don't beg you for what you've got. I've never done that. No one's got that story for me. Okay? So let these little... These little suck pussy, uh, suck pussy artists and some of these little suck pussy man them fall up and when they got rascal up balls, come and see me, bro. Lord Chemo, big up yourself, my G. Merry, 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 you know the thing. Happy New Year for the New Year when it comes in. Don't know the thing, my gentleman. I soon link you as well, you know, Chemo, because I need to jump on some of them mad beats. I got some fire to get off my chest, so no. I might think I'm done with them. Every time people draw me out, I'll just make them become the next topic of my music and my catalog. And my catalog's thick. My catalog's thick. Chemo, just inbox me your number, my bro. I'll phone you when I come off the live. And we link up. Definitely, bro. Ain't nothing, man. You don't know the thing already. We're, we're, we're active. <laughs> we're active. Mm. Man, am I just bad mind, bruv. Bad mind. You can't be... You can't beat me. You can't join me because I don't want none of these little suck pussy man them around me. You understand? None of them little suck pussy man them around. I don't care who's got a name. They all suck pussy and yam out. Girl on one bag of thing. I don't want none of them boy there around me. I'm a bad boy for them boy there. Mind them girl online. They will set you up. They will get you killed. And they will come to your funeral and cry around your children. So, uh, you know, you, you know, you, you always know the ones that are the culprits because when you go to the funerals, they're the, they're the ones that's crying the loudest. They want all the attention. Uh, uh, uh. None of that brings anybody back. Once you fucked up, you fucked up. Before we fuck up, let's look at what we're going to fuck up with. Let's put that right before it all goes left. I'm telling you straight. Because where you think it's going to go, it's not going to go down that way. The way you think in your mind, it's going to go. It's not going to go down that way. I'm here to be the fucking honest testimony to that shit. For those that don't believe, that don't know, that don't fucking know, because you only believe, wait until you see it in a real time, and then you'll get the shell shock of your life. Yeah. I'm not here to play games with no one. I'll make every pussy all an example if it needs to be, because it coming like people think they can keep drawing people out, pressing these buttons, using these little striggly, scraggly, scriggly, scraggly girls. These striggly scraggly, you know, do you know where I fly across the world? If I wanted gal and I was looking gal, do you know how much gal around the world I could rascal like, lay down with if it's that I'm looking? If I was that shallow minded, I fly all over the world. Regular. Scriggly Leah. Get the fuck out of here, man. What's wrong with these fucking guys? You have to try better than that. You got to go better than that, bro. You got to go... Killer's got standards and killer's got a level and height and these things. You can't come better than that, bro. That's how I show you. So you lot have run out. All of, all of your, your options have been run out. All of your ideas run out. All of all of your... your, your, your you get me? You, you've run out. You've run out. You've got to the bottom of the barrel. The bottom of the barrel is where you're at. You tried it with these, man, them. Cool, that's the bottom of the barrel to me. Yeah, niggas in the hood. That's not even someone that I don't know. That's not even someone that I don't know. If I was going to do it the opposite way, like reverse the curse on you, bro, it would be someone that you would never see it coming. You ain't got that brain like I have. So you send niggas that know my name and that I know their name. And when they say things, I can, I can say things back, innit? Because you lot are stupid. And when you send girls, you don't send a girl that ain't going to come back to you guys. You don't send a girl that we all mutually know. So no effort is really gone into what you're trying to do. No real investment has really gone into what you're trying to do. You lot are just low life trying to get by, trying to act up and trying to, uh, you know, achieve something with the bare minimum of what you got. Well, let me show you this. I'm not working with the bare minimum. I will give you the full belly of the beast if that's what you want. I'll give you the full 
chamber. I'll give you the full magazine. I'll give you the full drum. I'm not going to give you the bare minimum, pussy all. So when we're talking and when you're doing, do what you're doing, but know what you're doing. I don't mince my words. I don't care. I know what your intentions are. I'm just letting you know. Mine's is worse. Mine's for you is worse. That is all it is. And I don't care. I'm not trying to be the nicest guy. I don't want no one to like me. Don't have to like my shit. See where this is going. You get me? It's not about liking nothing. I'm just putting awareness out there. So people are aware that this is what's taking place under people's nose. Be careful. Because if it's... If I'm a target of that same nature, you could easily be a target of the same type of shit and won't see it coming. My brothers, keep your eyes open. My sisters, do better, please. Message for the day. Man, as I respect my people, have a blessed day. Heart of love, you know the trouble.